baby boxer pants for your daughter or son uh, now I'm going to cut uh, hip measurement or seat measurement uh, 22 inches you can uh, cut uh, 22 24 26 28 uh, same process okay now I'm going to cut 22 uh, the you can use uh, fabric or uh, piece of paper like this uh, this uh, width of the uh, of my uh, piece of paper uh, 22 inches at 3 inches is equal to 25 inches okay the length of the garment at 3 inches my uh, length of the garment uh, 7 and a half inches I at 3 inches is equal to uh, 10 and a half inches uh, Better you cut uh, one or uh, one or half inch more than okay. Now I fold like this. This one for back, this one for front. Okay, this is your uh, fabric, uh, good side. This is wrong side, and fold again. Now there are four layers here. 1, 2, 3, 4. There are 4 layers, layers here. This is my fold side. There are 2 folds like this. This one also fold. First, uh, for all. For all mean 22. See, oh, hip measurement 22, 24, 26, 20. For all. First, you measure uh, 3 and uh, 2 and quarters. Through an, uh, two and quarter inches. This is our uh, waistline. You should do it for your all measurements. Okay. Uh, then the length of the garment seven and a half inches. Okay. For others, uh, this one seven and a half inches. For others, uh, eight. Eight and half and nine and half inches. Okay, for this. The uh, front uh, body rise, front rise for this one, uh, six and half inches. Okay, for others, six and three quarters, seven inches and seven and half inches. Okay, for others, for your other measurements. I'll mark one inch from this level, my crotch level, for all your sizes, okay? And again, I measure one inch. I connect two points like this, okay? Uh, hip measurement or seat measurement, because of uh, you can use for your daughter or son. Uh, 22 inches divided by 4, uh, 5 and a half inches. Okay. Two and, uh, 5 and a half inches. Uh, I measured uh, waistline and hemline. Okay. I connect these two points. This is your uh, leg open. If you want to uh, reduce your but uh, this is the uh, pattern this is box box type but if you if you want you can change uh, like this a half inch or like this uh, don't connect this point you connect middle of the these two lines this is our uh, hip flavor this is our hip flavor you can use like this. Okay. But this one is better for box patterns. Okay. Uh, you should uh, stretch materials like velona, uh, single jersey or t-shirt materials, uh, four-way materials. Uh, okay. Uh, 
you can uh, use should add soil allowance if you want uh, you can cut uh, without soil allowance uh, but now but i uh, i'm going to add soil allowance draw like this here nice curve okay for all sizes For your uh, hem, I add uh, three quarters. I add three quarters. It depends on your pattern or and uh, your machine. Okay, it depends on your uh, fab. Uh, sorry, on your pattern and uh, on your machine because of if you want, you can. Uh, add uh, lace uh, or you can uh, add rib I mean rib you can measure rib here uh, okay for this side I add half inch for normal machine if you have a fat block machine no need to uh, so in a seam allowance like like this you can change your seam allowance okay i measure one inch for my back part your back part uh, uh, body rise increase one inch okay otherwise not nice from your back side i connect these two points this one our back Part. Uh, now I'm going to add one and quarter inch so in allowance it depends on your pattern and on your machine uh, pattern means uh, there are so many elastic uh, some elastic you should hide or uh, some uh, other elastic you can uh, sew on uh, your good side okay then you should then uh, you should uh, change your sewing allowance now i'm going to cut if you want uh, this is the line for box uh, patterns but if you want you can cut like this Okay, if you want, first of all, you should cut from back part and cut inch for this area. Okay, cut inch for this area. I open my block this one for back part okay this one for front part uh, now I'm going to change my sewing allowance uh, one and quarter inch you should change as your elastic okay now I'm going to cut my front side like this you should cut other two pieces uh, this is called uh, uh, gusset uh, there are uh, same measurement okay now I'm going to measure There are uh, three inches here, three and three both sides, uh, six inches. Six inches, okay.
this is my gusset uh, the length of the width of the gusset uh, one and three quarters enough for others two two and qu one quarter two and half inches okay you should cut two pieces if you difficult to sew this one uh, you call me okay or comment me this one back part this one front part okay these two pieces you should uh, sew like this okay there are two pieces Okay, thanks for watching.